All right, hello everyone. Um, today's video, I'm just gonna kind of show some, I had a request again for another base tour, which I'm not gonna do a full one because there's not really much to see besides my other ones, but I'll show you inside my core. I'll talk about uh, my mods. I just got a new cool mod, so I'm gonna show you that. And uh, yeah, I just I finished a revenge raid. So I'm back up to four skulls and it was a really good one, but somebody else had already, and it wasn't a crazy good one or anything, it was just a standard one, and I got a lot of stuff, but somebody else had already posted a video on it, so I'm not gonna bother. Um, and uh, so anyway, so this, here we go. Uh, I am down to two C4. I do have some floppies, but that's, that's all I got, and it's gonna be that way uh, until there's some major change um, with the way rating's going right now, but uh, all these hammers are cool. Uh, you, you need a lot of hammers for these melee mods, so I, I, every time I see one, I snatch it as quick as I can. Um, and, you know, gun oil, some tickets I'm a little low on. And my uh, blind one heads. And here's my scars. I've never used a scar besides a couple that I got that were not full. Um, I always save them. They're, they're pretty rare, so I don't bother using them. I got a lot of mods for them, but uh, I got another mod I need to finish for at the double barrel, but I didn't want to spend the parts on it yet, but actually I have a lot of parts. I might just go ahead and do that. Uh, most of my pythons are here. I'm not going to bother using those until they make a mod for it. I'm sure that'll be a, a valuable gun in the future. Um, I keep all my wrenches and my reserve gas in here. I mean, any further wrenches I got, I'm going to recycle them, but for right now, they're just, that's plenty. Um, I know once I start dipping into that gas, then I'm screwing up, so I start hitting the brakes on driving everywhere, which just happened recently, and now I'm already, you know, a few weeks later, I'm already stocked all the way back up. Um, there's my four uh, snorkels I found. Uh, most of my oak, my gas tanks, some turret parts, and... Uh, my rare paints, I still am missing the Fire Leopard and the Hello Kitty one. So definitely on the lookout for those. I want to have at least two of each one. Uh, I got four of these, I'm sorry, three of the size, three of the fishing rods, only one of which I crafted. Um, only one football helmet I found so far, and I never got the rest of the uh, Chinese armor. That's all I got from the event, and I was really hoping to find the boots and the helmet on a raid, because I heard you could, but I have yet to find it. Three energy drinks from the farm. I got four bones, and I can actually use three of those because I just got a mod for it. And I'm now at uh, 209 engine parts, so that's pretty cool. Whenever the ATV comes out, I'll be ready for whatever it is. I got almost 100 white paint, nine Z cards. Uh, these are my extra magazines on the ones that I'm maxed out on. And this bag of dog food I got during the anniversary event, and I'm going to save it for when I'm breeding like three pairs of level three dogs or something. Um, and hope I finally can get a, a level four. It's, it's been a long time to not have a level four. Uh, my VSSs and my minis and more pythons. Uh, I probably put five or six minis in the uh, recycler, maybe more than that. Uh, ones that weren't full durability. Um, I don't really like the mini guns for anything. I mean, they're all right, but I'm kind of same thing as the Python. I'll wait for a mod to come out or something for it before I ever feel like using them. Uh, some extra shotguns, and these are all my boy puppies that I knew were boys. I've probably thrown out a, a, at least some boy puppies just because, you know, way too many. And, you know, I'm just constantly getting nothing but boys relentlessly. Um, I'm gonna eat up here a second. Hold on. And uh, in the center here, I got my grenade launchers. Um, I think this one here I tried shooting once on a raid to test something out. Uh, my Guan Daos, how do you pronounce that? I got during the event, and I actually was thinking that would be pretty cool if they had made a machete mod that basically added like a long handle to machete and turned it into one of these, but uh, apparently that's not going to happen. 
Uh, I've got working my way up to 500 steel. I'm a little over 400 now. Um, my circuits and my floppies. So that's pretty much it in here. The steel, uh, you know, I'd probably have close to 500 right now if it wasn't for whatever all the steel I had to dump into the mods. Uh, I don't know what I want to do with this stuff. Um, if I were to use it to make walls, like I would, I'd want to, I'd love to do this interior wall all along here. Um, but if I were to use it and start upgrading it, all I would get is, let's say, this long wall right here and maybe three or four walls this way. That's all that that would do, which still would be something. I mean, if you were to come into my base from that direction, you'd be, you'd be screwed. So, um, but, you know, until I get to the point where I can do the whole thing, I probably am not going to use it. Who knows what the future holds? Uh, I always thought that, you know, there would be the zombie truck or something, which apparently they got rid of, and I might need to go build a base somewhere else, and I might need the steel to start off there and build a core. They always talking about uh, some kind of a clan base, in which case you might need to contribute resources, and you know they, you don't know really what the future holds. So I'm just kind of still stocking it up uh, for the meantime, and then we'll see. We'll see how that goes. Um, and uh, I'll show you my mods here. So that's, that's it for my little base tour. That's all I'm going to do on that. Uh, so I finally got to level 42 on firearms, and that's when you go up to 19%. I don't know what the max is, if it's just 20% when you get to level 50 or 21, 22, I don't know. But um, so I have that, and... Uh, my mechanics I haven't done much with. I could get up to 50 pretty quick on that. I got tons of engine uh, generators and whatnot. I finally got my melee up to 11. Once you get to 11, that's when you start getting 1% for leather and, you know, the planks. It's pretty lame. So I was hoping there would be something better, but I don't know why you can't get melee mods from uh, melee weapons like you can with guns, but that's apparently how it works. And that's a real shame. It, it, it does take, even though you, every 10 minutes you can put a new one in, it still seems to take forever. You don't get a lot of credit for them. Uh, I'm ready to go exchange all this stuff in for another uh, mod at the bunker. I think of all the exchanges I've done, and I've done like five of them or something, I've only gotten one good mod out of that. I don't remember what it was. It was a long time ago. Um, so, but, you know, at least you can, at least they don't go to waste. You can at least tr take another shot at it. I got 46 gun parts and 14 carbon composites. Lenses I'm definitely low on. And the only other thing really left to show is my new mod here that I'm pretty happy about. I uh, finally got a bone mod and it's this one. Um, so I have four bones. This one requires three. I think there's only like four or maybe six mods that require bones. It's not a lot. And most all of them come with like a pretty big downside. This one only is like negative durability, which I don't really care about. Um, but some of the other ones uh, take away speed or range or whatever. So it's, they, they add a lot, but they take away a, a, enough to not make them as awesome as they, you'd think they'd be considering how hard it is to get bones. But at least for me, other people say they get, get them left and right, but I've only got four so far. So once I get, uh, once I get 10 pipes, I could craft them, but I'm just going to wait until I get the 10 pipes from different things, and I'll go ahead and up this, and that in conjunction with the handle should make that a pretty decent weapon. Um, I mean, you never know. JCF kind of talked about this, but uh, the way it works, and a good example of this is the shovel. The shovel used to be, uh, when, it, when the shovel was... You know, the shovel a long time ago, uh, many updates ago, the shovel used to be that you could sneak attack a fast biter in one hit, and it would take three hits normally. I think it was three. And if you, and then they did a, a nerf on it that where they lowered the damage just enough that the sneak attack didn't quite kill them. It took two hits, and it took four hits. And suddenly, I used to use a shovel left and right because it was the cheapest thing and it was very effective. And suddenly they nerfed it just that tiny bit of damage to make it not no longer effective, and I stopped using the shovel. I mean, it was it was my main go-to weapon, so cheap to, to make, and then suddenly it wasn't worth it anymore. Um, so that's kind of how it works with all these mods. You can get 
you could up your damage a whole bunch and max out some weapon and find that it doesn't kill anybody any faster. It still takes two hits or three hits to kill a thing. So it, it just depends on how the numbers work out, whether or not something's really worth it. Um, you know, maybe someday somebody that has more time than me will uh, do a good chart on how that actually works and which weapons you actually get a good benefit from and which ones you don't. Um, but I imagine the pipe might be one of those weapons that doesn't work out that much better than just simply getting the, the basic mods on it. I mean, just getting the uh, can, uh, just simply getting this can mod here on the top here might make it as effective as, as it can be, and all the rest of it's just a big waste. So, uh, so that's it for now. Um, I, I did finally get a girl dog that I bred and made a pretty decent one here. It was Bloodhound 5 and uh, Hunter 5, and I'm waiting for it to turn into another boy, a level 3 boy, hopefully. And uh, so we'll see if I get a decent one out of that. But um, yeah, that's it for now. Uh, I will see you on the next one. All right, bye-bye.